What's going on YouTube? It's Mike here. Today guys in this video I'm going to be showing you the new cool features of iOS 7.1 beta 3 and how to get it now. So as you guys know, just a few days ago now, Apple unleashed iOS 7.1 beta 3. Now this is the third beta from iOS 7.1. There's already been two and I haven't made videos about them just because, you know, they haven't had drastic changes. Well, since beta 3 was released on January 7th, there are quite dramatic changes as you can see by these screenshots here, as well as a method that was actually patched in beta 2, but I waited till beta 3 to show for this video, a method that was patched uh, to actually download the betas on your iOS devices of like iOS 7, new builds of iOS 7, of course, in the beta stages for free without registering your UDID. So that was unfortunately patched. And so in this video, I'm going to be showing you a different method to get your UDID registered. So as you can see here, basically 7.1 beta 3, uh, they've changed a lot of the buttons, especially within the phone app. You could see here the phone app. Uh, now the phone button has become like a little circle when you make a call. Same, you know, when you're on the phone you get a little circle for the end call rather it be the big bars that it used to the slide to power off have changed completely from bars to circles much like we had in iOS 6 so you could definitely tell that they want to stick with like a circle design now which is pretty cool uh, they've they've reduced motion you could shut it off or on on wallpapers which is awesome I've been waiting for a feature like that um, and you know there's some little tweaks here and there a lot of bug fixes like these music uh, text bubbles are now highlighted when you click on them and then you can reduce transparency, darken colors, reduce white points. There's a lot of new things that they've changed in 7.1, particularly very much in beta 3. And so since it's made such a significant impact and I figured a lot of you'd want it, I figured I'd make a video to show you exactly how to get it. Now, while the free way is now patched, there's actually an easier and pretty cheap way to get your UDID registered as well. And that is UDIDregistrations.com. It's a very simple site, and for $4.99, just $4.99, you can register your UDID, whether it be an iPhone, iPad, or iPod Touch, that is running iOS 7, and let's say you want to get you know, the 7.1 beta, particularly beta 3 or future betas, you can use UDID registration services. So like I said, it's pretty much simple. It's five bucks and they're very quick with their service and they register you and you're pretty much set. And then you're provided the download links to the IPSW files of the betas of iOS 7, you know, 7.1, future maybe 7.2, you never know what could come out. So you'll be able to get it through this service. It's very simple. They've actually went ahead and registered my UDID uh, on my iPhone 5S and I'm running the beta 3 version of 7.1 and I gotta tell you, it's very cool. And so, you know, there's buy now instructions and they have packages you could buy for $4.99 per device. You could buy bronze, like you could, you could just compare it. You could get like the gold and that'll give you everything. You could get UDID registration, expedited processing, certificate and provisioning, member status, device replacement, and so on. So you could choose your package within the UDIDregistrations.com slash buy section of the site. I'll leave all links in the description to their site so you guys could check it out. I definitely recommend it. This will have you locked in for the 7.1 beta and future iOS 7 betas. And even if you want to continue registering with them, you know, later in the year or something, or later on maybe when iOS 8 comes out around WWDC 2014, that's most likely for sure going to be happening in June, you know, you're going to want to have your UDID registered. Uh, for something since they've patched the glitch until until we could see another glitch or kind of trick or way to actually get the betas for free we're gonna have to be getting someone to register them for us however you won't have to pay that hundred dollars up front that Apple charges for a simple five bucks you could just get your UDID registered and you wind up saving ninety five dollars essentially so that's it guys, it's pretty simple. If you want to get the new betas and all this cool stuff and you want to continue to get future betas, you know, if you want to be running iOS 8 when it comes out in June and not have to wait until September, then I definitely recommend UDIDregistrations.com site because again, for five bucks, you pretty much have all access to beta stuff that regular customers and users wouldn't have access to. So go check it out. Again, a link will be in the description. Definitely recommend it. It's Mike's iOS help approved if you want to say. Um, but thank you guys for watching this video. If you like the please leave some comments below on your thoughts. Let me know if you registered your device with these guys. Uh, they hooked me up with the registration for this video. Uh, and that's why I recommend them for sure. You definitely want to try them out. Uh, of course, rate, give this video a thumbs up. And click the subscribe button below. And I'll catch you guys in the next video.